Hello, good afternoon, everybody, and you are welcome to a brand new video from Sam Safe Factory. I am Savior, an executive, and also the social media manager for Sam Safe Factory. And in today's video, I'll be walking through some of those machines that you need for bottled water production. We've gotten a lot of questions on Instagram, also here on YouTube, and people that also call us to say, which kind of machine do I need for bottled water production? Like, walk me through this entire process. What and what are those things that I need to set up a bottled water production? So, in this video, we'll be focusing specifically on bottled water production and some of those machines required for you to set up a bottled water production factory. And by the way, before I continue, this video is in collaboration with Bevicota Technology. Bevicota Technology is a packaging machine supplier here in Abuja, Nigeria. They also have branch offices all over the country too. And they supply industrial machines for bottled water production, um, water treatment, home and industrial, and also bakery machines too. So if you are in need of any of these machines, you can use the link in the description box. You will find the link to their Instagram account and also all their contact information in the description box. This list is also approved by the Standard Organization of Nigeria. They visited our factory, they checked our machines, and they approved them. So you can be rest assured that these machines and this list I'm giving to you is a comprehensive list of all the things that are required and needed for you to set up. The first machine we have here on the list is the Dingley Monoblock machine. This is the machine that comprises of all the washing, filling, and capping of the bottles in a bottled water production line. So this machine currently costs from around 8.5 million Naira above. The reason why I'm saying above because we know the prices and the market when it comes to buying and selling of industrial machines like this. There is market fluctuation when it comes to pricing and the exchange rate. So you can only have an estimated price. And in a country like Nigeria, in most cases, some of these prices go up. They don't come down. So you can just budget from 8.5 million Naira and above if you are thinking of buying the monoblock machine. There are other machines to the company, the monoblock machine, that brings out the beauty of a packaged bottled water. But the monoblock machine, which carries out the washing, filling, and capping of your bottle, is the important, or should I say the first machine you should get for you to set up a bottled water production factory. So the next machine you will need is the air conveyor and the steam leveler. So the air conveyor is the machine that actually pushes your bottles after they've been blown. We'll get to that machine very soon. After you have your bottles with you, because this is a semi-automatic monoblock machine. So after you've had the bottles with you, you put it in the air conveyor. The air conveyor sends your bottle down to the monoblock machine, the main monoblock unit. That's when it goes through the washing process, the filling process, and the capping process. Now, after this bottle is done with all these processes, it passes through the conveyor again that leads it to the steam leveler. So the steam leveler is the machine that attaches your, la your label, your branded label, with your bottle. So if you've used a branded bottle before, like if you've drank a branded bottled water before, let me show you an example. This is um, a 5CL Sam Safe bottle. And you can see how neatly labeled this bottle is. So this is the work of the steam labeling machine. It attaches the label to the bottle. This machine costs anywhere from around 900,000 and above. And for the quantity for each of this machine, the monoblock machine, you need one of it. And for the steam um, labeler and the air conveyor, you just need one of each. So moving to our next machine, the next machine you will need is the cap loader. So the cap loader is the machine that sends the cap to the cap loader that actually caps the bottle. Now it is structured in such a way that this can be done manually or can be done automatically. So the cap loader sends the caps automatically. Well, if you don't have the cap loader, you have to do this manually by climbing the machine itself and turning the caps into the cap loader which can interrupt the whole production process. So it is advisable for you to get this machine and also include it to your production line. And for this machine, you only need one of these. And it costs around 
1.4 million naira and above. The next thing you will need is the receiving and holding table. And you will need to have a holding table because this elevates to the top of the table equal to the size of the um, steam leveling machine. So that immediately the bottle comes out of the steam leveling machine, it lands on the receiving table. So you will need around two of this and, and this table costs from 100,000 and above. The next machine you will need for your bottled water production is the shrink sleeve machine, the shrink tunnel or the shrink wrapping machine. So this is the machine that collects the bottled water. After you've collected everything on your receiving table, your holding table, you pack your bottles, you arrange them in the shrink wrapping machine, insert your shrink wrapping film and you start wrapping your bottles. Now if you've gone to a supermarket or you visited a warehouse or a huge store, you will see how these bottled waters are packed. This is the work of the shrink wrapping machine. So you will need one of this machine depending on your production. Maybe if you have like three of the monoblock machines and you have like 50,000 bottles per day production, you will need more shrink wrapping machine. But for you just starting out, you will need only one of these machines. So immediately you collect your bottles from the steam labeler, you're able to send it immediately to the shrink wrapping machine and have your bottles wrapped and packaged neatly. By the way, I will advise that for some of these machines, you might be tempted to buy a second hand machine but advisably, for most of these machines, it is advised that you buy a new one because we have experience with a second-hand machine and to be honest with you, it's not funny. When you buy a second-hand machine, you don't know the kind of hell that that machine has been through. <laughs> you don't know how long they've been using that machine. So if that machine should get to your hand, you'll just keep on spending money on repairs, which might even cost you more than buying a new machine. So it is advisable that you buy a new machine when it comes to your bottled water production. And the shrink wrapping machine costs around 3 million naira and above. So if you are going to the market or you are contacting Berit for you to buy the shrink wrapping machine, just have anything from 3 million naira in your hand and above because of the market situation when it comes to buying these machines. The next machine you will need for your bottled water production is the stretch blowing machine. Now this blowing machine is the machine, if you follow us on Instagram, you've seen a lot of, <laughs> you've seen a lot from our blowing machine. This blowing machine is the machine that you use to put in your preforms, that's your raw materials, your pet bottles, and you actually blow it into an actual size. Now for the pet blowing machine, you will need one of these, a heater and compressor. Although these are optional, but it is important and all these things are necessary. In sure, I don't even think any of this is optional. You need all of this for it to have like a standard factory and for your production to go on smoothly. Sometimes some people go into the business without a blowing machine to actually blow their own bottles. But it is advisable and also cheaper for you to purchase your own blowing machine. And this blowing machine costs anywhere from around 6.5 million naira and above. So if you are going to the market for you to buy this machine, just know in mind that this is the price range of what it will cost you to acquire a blowing machine. Setting up a bottled water production factory is not cheap. And the blowing machine blows around 800 bottles per hour. The next thing you will need is water filter and air chiller for a blowing machine. Now this is important because by the time your blowing machine works for an extended period of time, or depending on the weather condition situation in your area, the blowing machine might get extremely hot. So it is important that you have these two external machines to support your blowing machine and keep it at the right temperature for your production to go on smoothly. The water chiller and air filter cost around 1.5 million naira and above. So you should also have this in mind when going into the market for you to buy these machines. The next thing you will need here is the pet blowing mold. So now the pet blowing mold is the mold that brings out the shape of your bottles. Now there's a mold for 35 cl, for 50 cl, and also 75 cl. These are the molds which we currently use. So having these three different molds open up your options in the market to so either sell 35 cl bottles, 50 cl, or 75 cl. So it is important for you to have these three molds. And each of the molds costs anywhere from 500,000 naira and above. So just have it in mind that if you are going for the three, you know you are spending at least 500,000 for each of them. 
and you might just have only two of them depending on which one you would like to produce at the moment but if you have a blowing machine why not take advantage of just buying the three modes and diversify your market and you know more products in the market so the bottle mold is also important when it comes to bottled water production i think it's one of the most important things to that you need because for you to have the shape of your bottles you need mold in short all these things are very important all of them all of them are very important <laughs> so the next machine you will need is the inkjet machine and the inkjet machine is the printer that prints the manufacturing date on your labels and the expiry date on your labels. Any other additional detail that you need to include on your bottles manually, this can be done with the inkjet printer. Although this is optional, but it is also required because after every production of your bottled water or before the production of your bottled water, you have to beat them and label the manufacturing date and the expiring date. So it is important for you to also get this machine. This machine costs anywhere from 3 million naira and above. So have this in mind. You only need one and it produces up to 800 characters per second when you are using this machine. The next machine you will need here is the water sterilizer. This machine is the final machine, the treatment machine where water passes through before entering the monoblock machine. So if there are bacteria and organisms that have been able to withstand all the treatment, right from the filter cartridges, the reverse osmosis, and any other treatment process that water must have gone through. The ultraviolet water sterilizer is the last bus stop for these microorganisms. And you can expect a smooth production process with a production of up to 2,500 liters per hour that's coming from this water sterilizer. And this machine costs anywhere from 3 million naira and above. So you can have this at hand when going to the market for your water production machines the next machine you will need here is the pumping machine so the steel pumping machine is what pushes water from your borehole or your treatment tanks from your water source to the monoblock machine you will need one of these and this costs anywhere from 90,000 naira and above so you can have this at hand when going to the market for production machines all these things that i've just mentioned here i'm sure if you are able to get a list of all of them and you visit the showroom of basic water technology they have a showroom here in abuja you can go there and see the machines for yourself if you even need testing they can take you to some of the factories that they've actually installed the machines there and you can see how they are being used so if you are interested in seeing these machines in action you can give a call to basic water technology the last thing you will need are your water filter cartridges and this costs anywhere from 10,000 naira and above. So the water filter cartridges are those cartridges that help you trap your water, treat them, and absorb any bacteria that might be inside the water. So these are all the machines and the equipments you will need for you to set up a bottled water production. Only bottled water in this case. This video is just for bottled water. So I hope you enjoyed this video and you find it, and you found it very informative. You can reach out to us by sending us an email and you can also reach out to basic water technology to all the links and the contact information will be in the description box by the way don't forget to also leave a comment if there's any video or any question that you have you can leave a comment i'll go through them and upload a video about them also check out our instagram i post videos of our production process what's going on in the factory all of them i post them on instagram so follow the Instagram and also subscribe to us on YouTube for you to get double content and get inspired to set up your water production factory or to push on harder on your business. So thank you all for watching this video. Until the next video, bye-bye.